Now here's how you can use coordinates in Google Maps on iPhone. So when you start using the map like this, it doesn't matter if you're in the satellite or the default view, right? You can just look around the map and everything. So how does it work in terms of coordinates? Well, essentially any point on the map which you tap on, whether it's already like selected in here as a restaurant or even if you drop a pin manually in here, Essentially, when you swipe up a little bit, you can see the address and everything, but when you click on see all, you're going to be able to see more information about it, right? So uh, you can see the exact address and usually uh, stuff which isn't, you know, like marked on the map, it's going to give you some coordinates, right? So when I just go in here, uh, you're going to be able to notice that there are some additional information in here. So as you can see, for example, when I hold down on this like place on a map, I can see the exact address and everything, but also the coordinates, which are right here. So I can just, you know, copy this like number and everything, right? So it just works and I can just place or paste it somewhere else, save the exact spot, whatever, right? So that's, that's just how it works. And also it works the other way around. So I can easily just paste this into the search right when i just look this up through the coordinates because it might happen that you have these like numbers the coordinates for a specific place so you can easily just paste them into the search and it's going to get you to this very location so it works very well well it's also worthy to to know that if you just select like a very specific like shop in here it tries not to give you the exact coordinates because, you know, it's much more useful to get the exact, like, you know, map address and like the number of the house. So the coordinates work much better for places which are not marked on a map, you know, some in the middle of the field or forest or something. So this is what it's useful for. But, you know, these is just trying to give you only the, you know, the address and not really the exact coordinates, right? So that's kind of how it works so yeah also if you like to you might as well use the google earth if you really want to because you know using this you have some more options in here as well because you can check out some specific points on the map as well and you have like better view even for the coordinates and you also can paste in the you know the numbers and it's just going to get you there as well so it just works the same way but you get like a little bit more features through the google earth so this is how it works hope you found this video helpful hit the thumbs up subscribe below and i'm going to catch you in the next video